St. John chapter 14, verse 6, and it reads, Yahweh Shai saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Next, double honors to the head apostle slash elder bishops of Great Millstone, the one that taught us the 100% truth according to the Bible, peace, blessings, and safety. To all you sincere items, keep pushing, keep believing, keep the faith. Regardless of people here for a bit, we're not going to make it up out of here without Lord Yahweh Shai, who they even call Jesus. We're not making it out of here, man. Lord Yahweh Shai is coming with healing in his wings. Meaning when he pull up with the chariots, the heavenly hosts, to deliver the elect of the nation of Israel. The only way we gain access to the heavenly father is through his son. We must always remember this, Israel. Always remember this. I was just sitting here, just thinking, man. Just, th just thankful as I don't know what for this word for Yahweh Shai. Thanking the Heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh, for Yahweh Shai. He saves, He delivers, man. Matter of fact, let's just get that right quick. Let's just get it right quick. Thanking the Heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh. For Yahweh Shai, St. Matthew chapter 1, St. Matthew chapter 1, verse 21, and it reads, And she, Lord Yahweh Shai's mother Mary, and she shall bring forth a son, and thou shalt call his name Yahweh Shai. He saves, he delivers, for he shall save his people from their sins. Sitting just, just thinking the Heavenly Father, thinking the Most High Yahweh. For Yahweh Shai, our Lord and Savior, man. We don't deserve it. That's why we constantly go over Psalms 51 over and over and over and over and over and over each and every day in our heads. Whether we reading it or we meditating on it, we don't want the Lord to take his Holy Spirit away from us because we, we, we know we're through. Without that, without the Holy Spirit, we're through. So we thank Yahweh for Yahweh Shai. St. Matthew 1, 21, because that's, that's the door. That's how you gain access. That's how we gain access to eternal life, Lord's will. Through Yahweh Shai. And we're going to see if we can get that too. St. Matthew chapter 1, verse 21. And she shall bring forth his son, and thou shalt call his name Yahweh Shai. He saves, he delivers, right? For he shall save his people. Not everybody, his people, the Israelites. Who's the Lord's people? The Israelites. From their sins, from their transgressions, man. From their wickedness. From them breaking the law. That's who saves. That's who delivers. Lord, yeah, how I? So I want, I want to go. I want to go right back to this right quick. Just something quick. I was just sitting here just thinking, man. Thinking the Heavenly Father, the Most High, Yahweh, for His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. Once again, that's how we gain access to the Heavenly Father. Let's get this again. St. John chapter 14, verse 6. And Yahweh Shai, our Savior, saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. That's who quickened us, right? That's who quickened us. That's who made us live again. Lord Yahweh Shai, through these words, right? Through the Comforter. No man cometh unto the Father but by me and we go over this over and over through the spirit you got israelites saying all praises to the heavenly father well 
The Heavenly Father said the only way that you can get through him, the only way that we can gain access to him is through his son. That's why we say all praises, all praises, all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. We praise the Heavenly Father in the name of Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakodash. That, 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 that's the only way, Israel. And, 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 I'm, and I'm proving everything through the scriptures. Everything that, that I'm saying, I'm proving it through the scriptures. This is Ephesians chapter 2. This is just something quick. I was just saying, just thinking. All kind of lessons was going through my mind. But the Lord, but the Lord was like, nah, here, here you go. Here you go. Ephesians chapter 2, verse 18. For through him, Yahweh Shai, we both have access by one spirit unto the Father. Didn't we just read that in St. John, the 14th chapter? Through him, Lord Yahweh Shai, he saves, he delivers. That's, that's how we gain access to the Heavenly Father. And, and, and that's plain. That, that, look, that's the door. That's the door. One more time, Ephesians. Chapter 2, verse 18, and it reads, For through him, Yahweh Shai, we, the Israelites, Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians, both have access by one spirit unto the Father. The Heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh. We can't just go straight to the Heavenly Father. There's an order with everything. Plus, we indeed defile bodies. The Heavenly Father is too pure to look upon iniquity. We, we're in this sinless flesh. And you still got Israelites talking some all praises to the Most High. He ain't hear, hear you. The Heavenly Father don't hear us, okay? Part of, what part of that don't you understand? You, you Israelites still don't get it. You, you don't know what you're involved in. You know, and you're looking crazy out there, man. Let's get this right quick. A couple more scriptures, then I'm going to wrap it up. I just had something on my mind. Had something on my mind. Let's get this. St. John chapter 5. Let's see. So I'm just, I'm just hitting some points, then I'm going to wrap it up. We'll start, we'll start at, um, matter of fact, we'll start at 19. Then answered Yahweh Shai and said unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, the son can do nothing of himself, but what he seeth the Father do. Two separate entities. Two separate entities. You got the Heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh. He is, he exists, and his only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. He saves, he delivers, right? And Lord Yahweh Shai said, I can't do nothing without the Father. For what things soever he doeth, these also doeth the Son likewise. For the Father loveth the Son. And show of him all things that himself doeth. And he will show him greater works than these that ye may marvel. For as the Father raiseth up the dead and quickeneth them, so even the Son, two separate entities, quickeneth whom he will. The word quickeneth means to make alive, right? For the Father judges no man, but have committed all judgment unto the Son. So, so who's judging the people upon the face of the earth? Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai is sending forth them spirits, creative avengers. Yahweh Shai is making the evils, the bad times happen. All, all of the above, Yahweh Shai is sending forth the earthquakes, the storms, sending forth them different spirits. You see? Because remember, Lord Yahweh Shai said, Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai said, Look, I'm going to visit the earth with thunder. With earthquakes, with storm and tempest, and the flame of the fire and fire. Lord Yahweh is controlling all that. The Heavenly Father said, I gave, I committed all judgment unto the Son, that all men should honor the Son. That all men should honor the Son. You got Israelites on the face of the earth. They're not honoring the Son. They're not honoring Yahweh Shai, our Lord and Savior. When you got the Heavenly Father said that all men should honor his Son. That all men, not some men, but all Israelite men, 
should honor the sun. And the whole earth eventually is going to honor the sun. Eventually, the whole earth, every knee is going to bow real soon. That all men should honor the sun. Even as they honor the father. Do, do you get that? Two separate entities. Did you, was, that, was that clear? I mean, do I need to blow the scripture up? So for all you Israelites coming on the board, telling us some all praises to the Heavenly Father, or either you come on the comment board, telling us some all praises, all praises to who? Give, look, give us a name. Who, who are you worshiping? Who are you praising? Give us a name. We don't leave nothing on the board, period. The Heavenly, the Heavenly Father just told you all men should honor His Son. That's how we honor the Heavenly Father through His Son. That all men should honor the Son, even as they honor the Father. He that honor, listen, good, you Israelites. He that honoreth not the Son, honoreth not the Father, which have sent him. Is that clear enough? So the only way that we can honor the heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh, is through His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. Yeah, yeah, this is plain. It's right there on the screen. I'm leaving it up there for a minute on purpose. And we're supposed to meditate upon these things, man. Right? That's the bread of life. Lord Yahweh Shai is the bread of life. Just read and I'm saying, Lord Yahweh Shai is our access to the Father. That's the only way that we can gain access to the Father is through the Son. But look, but, but you have it your way, though. You look, you have it your way. You see, you don't believe in the record that the heavenly father gave of his only begotten son. Then you 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 have it your way. You see? And and, and I ain't, ain't gonna really I ain't gonna make this long. Just, just, just show something short through the spirit. We thank the heavenly father, the most high Yahweh, for Yahweh Shai. Having faith in Yahweh Shai. Let's see what else, Lord, before I close out. Let's see what else. And Lord Yahweh Shai is all over the scriptures. Bear, bear with me. Malachi chapter 4 verse 2. But unto you that fear my name shall the son of righteousness. Lord Yahweh Shai, that's who's coming. Shall the son of righteousness arise with healing in his wings when he come with the chariots. That, that's who's coming in the chariots. Lord Yahweh Shai is coming with the heavenly hosts. What does the scripture say? Then shall appear the Son of Man coming in the clouds. Remember, remember that? Let's get this Malachi 4 and 2. But unto you that fear my name, it's just all about that name. Look, without the name, there's no salvation. You Israelite, like you still don't get that either, though, right? Been around all these years. Been around all these years, but you still can't come to the conclusion that without the name, there's no salvation. But unto you that fear my name, Yahweh, through his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, shall the son of righteousness arise with healing in his wings. And ye shall go forth and grow up as calves of the star. Matter of fact, let's just get this. What is it? Um, St. Luke. Matthew, let's get Matthew 24th chapter. I'm thinking this is the one. And then this ain't nothing long. I was just sitting here just thanking the Heavenly Father for Yahweh Shai. Our Lord and Savior, man. St. Matthew chapter 24. See if this is the one I want. Yep, this is what I want. St. Matthew chapter 24. I'll read 30 and 31. St. Matthew chapter 24, verse 30, and it reads, Then shall appear the sign of the Son of Man, Lord Yahweh Shai, in heaven, coming through with the chariots, right? And then shall all the tribes of the earth mourn. And they shall see the Son of Man, Lord Yahweh Shai, coming in the clouds, in the chariots, the spaceships, and the clouds. Look, look, it's going, it's going to block out the sun and everything. The clouds of heaven. With power and great glory. The Lord is coming in his power. And look, look, with great glory. Lord Yahweh Shai. That Yahweh Shai. He saves, he delivers. That's why we got to thank the Heavenly Father for Yahweh Shai. St. Matthew 24, 31. 
and he shall send, and Yahweh shy, and he shall send his angels with a great sound of a trumpet, and they shall gather together his elect, his elect, not all Israel, but his elect. And Lord willing, we part of that whole for number, man. Lord willing, we pray. And we know we're not even counting worthy, but we constantly pray to Yahweh Bashim El Shad that he sees, he counts us worthy to make it out of this doom and gloom. Make it out of them missiles hitting this place, man, and certain other parts of the earth. And they shall gather together his elect from the four winds from one end of heaven to the other. See how important Lord Yahweh Shai is? See how important our Savior is? This is the, the Lord of Lords, the King of Kings. The, look, the, look, the bread of life, the fountain of living water. Look, 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 the door. All the, all the above, man. Yeah, so I ain't going to be the dead horse. My job, I was just saying, just thinking, man, thinking the Heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh, for Yahweh Shai. That's the only way we're going to make it out of here, Israel. Lord willing, we have that number. Only way we're going to make it out of here is through Yahweh Shai. Giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Bahashem. Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rakakwadash. Next double honors to the head apostle slash elder bishops of Great Millstone, the one that taught me the 100% truth according to the Bible. Peace, blessings, and safety to all you sincere Akims. Keep pushing, keep believing, keep the faith. Regardless of people here for a bear. Thanking the Heavenly Father, the Most High Yahweh, for Yahweh Shai. Shalom.